Uh, if Tom rebirth the Daedalus, she gets crit better than coup de gras with a freezer tonic on top. Leo beams at Envy after Gigi's called. And Gunner, get out of here. Walrus punch. The impale comes through and Gunner goes down. There's the GG and without the face is void. What are you going to do? Oh. There it is. Oh. <laughs> Who is the animal, Mr. Envy? Say it out loud. <laughs> the BM. There's a grudge bat here. Oh. Go SA server game to. Oh my god, Ricky. <laughs> oh, baby. Yikes. Uh, they might get a penalty for that one, to be honest. As hilarious as that is, you. <sighs> and a drama. Literal 12 year olds. He has to be with everyone that's not TE1 because he calls them all animals. Le Leo Insta DC has a losing game too. <laughs> Classic. You never be him after punch. game one. That's a mistake. Getting a uh, free roast. They very much needed that. There was no way they'd take a fight and beat from this lineup at the moment. <laughs> Classic. Where is it? He's a uh, level 26 now on the clip. Sort of. And, uh. <laughs> is this the same team? That's just the tankiness. Oh, that just made the difference. This is the wrong the game, though, Skip. Uh, this game last I don't time even know these the players. Uh, not, I don't think the is a bloodbath. He's doing that on ping. <laughs> what was the team? <laughs> that is pretty Four insane. Is he managed to accomplish that. A little bit of armor. Where is it? Am I blind? I want to see him disconnecting. And Gunner, get out of here. Walrus. Okay, I am at. Can Gunner get out of here? Walrus punch. The impale comes through and Gunner goes. The uh, Aurora with the. Uh, even slowed down by the map before TI, but after TI. Here we go, here we go. 40 explosions times 28 uh, damage. Beat himself with his build. Palliate Aura is like funny. Oh, they were even winning. I mean, it's just looks oh like. Oh my god, they're winning with 10k and they throw as well. <laughs> oh, that makes it even juicier. So farmed. They're winning the with 10k. Boots travel on his way. Dude, I'm not sure if you know some. There's gonna be the tear away. Turn his attention on over to the Abaddon. Grimstroke <laughs> down, down this base, and that is it. Zoomers tied <laughs> up. A little one, bitch. One. Quick DC from Leo this time around. She <laughs> was on the other foot here in a game that. Oh, please tell me they lost the series. Oh, oh it's so smart. What Wait, eight. there's only two games? There's gonna be the tear away. Turn his attention on over to the Abaddon. Our own time's gonna save him for now. Uh, when Leo is the next free con? Is it a Is it not free content in forever? Which tournament is this? BTS. This? E Summer Punk. Who's FJ? Who's Leo? Am I retarded again? Oh, it is this game. Who is he? The carry? Because I am the least racist. I mean, retarded. I'm also the least racist. I don't know why you think I'm retarded. Well, please buff the fountain. Why? Okay, let's let's explain why this guy is wrong. Let's hear his argument out. Hello, this is a quick post about what I think Hello. feels wrong with the fountain. I'm not a pro, and I'm only talking from my own personal experience. 
Also, this post wasn't made right after losing a match because of these issues, but I encountered them throughout my most recent matches and for quite some time now. Increase the damage the fountain does to your opponents equally. This means that evasive, tanky, and targetable and illusion heavy heroes need to feel these increases all the same. They do. I recognize that fountain diving is part of Dota 2 and I certainly agree, but fountain farming is not acceptable. Make the fountain more of a safe space. <laughs> this means that while in the fountain you should be able to heal up quicker, or be somewhat affected by damage reducing effects. I do not think that becoming invulnerable is the right thing to do simply because I appreciate fountain diving being a viable niche tactic, but the current iteration does not prevent you from dying. Against just the regular hero, that is capable of damaging you in the fountain. It's a good thing these people don't decide what to do. Fountain farming is part of Dota, as he says. Uh, if you do it too much, you die though, because they have added Fury Swipes on it, so you can't stay in it. There's nothing to prevent Fountain Camping though. Uh, but how often does that happen? Keep it, but give it multi shots. As heroes with unit spam like PL can just tank the fountain with fodder like illusion. So, so, PL can found him. every hero can found him for him. You can just stand it with punch outside and keep hooking. Like, do you need to? Do you need to get like an anti hook thing in in the fountain? Then, like every hero has some way of doing it. Not every hero, but a lot of heroes. We need to add uh, multi-shot, we need to add like a bubble to prevent hooking, we need to prevent enemies from putting uh, wards or get vision in it so they can't get vision and force us out, we need to blah blah blah. How about you just shut the fuck up? How about you just accept that you lost and just AFK for a minute as they destroy your base? Idiot Bulldog. Whoa, whoa, this is a positive stream. Whoa, you also wrote, you're racist. Okay, I got him. This is the least racist stream on Twitch. I am the least racist person. No, but you cannot buff the fountain. There's no point. There are two types of fountain camping. The people stay outside and just keep keep you in there while uh, the game can go on for 30 minutes. There's nothing you can do about that. And for the occasional dives that people do at the end of the game, why would you want to nerf that? I don't understand. I don't understand. 